Hello, uh, welcome back to my channel. <clears throat> I am actually in my tea room and I decided to put a slim tree in here. So I'm going to put it over in this little corner because it's going to be the perfect spot for it. Now, um, I just want to say welcome, welcome to all you new people. Love you guys. I'm glad you guys stopped by to see what's up with me. I enjoy Christmas. I love decorating. And since I found out that my mom might be coming down, I decided to decorate my tea room, uh, the guest room, the bedrooms. So I will take you along as I go through the process. Now, my boss up tree, I will be showing that in a home tour. I did lose a little footage of that. It was storming here really bad. I don't know why, but um, I am currently done with that tree. Now, the first thing that I would like to do is freshen up my space. So, I like to use the Lysol to clean with. It's with the lemon and it freshens up the space. And I also use the Windex with vinegar for my mirrors. So we're going to get started. I have a bird outside my window. Don't ask me why it keeps coming back, but um, it's there. Anywho, my ideal was instrumental. And I'll tell you why. I sit in this tea room sometimes. Um, with my Danish and tea um, or I'll have a bagel and tea I'm a tea drinker so I like coming up here my little quiet zone my meditation room and I'll put on my music so this gave me uh, the inspiration to decorate this room. Not only that, my mom's coming. So, that's what I choose to do. I'm going to get the baseboards. Um, this is the best time for me. It's just me screwing on the top. To get the baseboards because um, there's nothing there so I might as well clean them and it's only going to take a second to get this area clean now remember I had mentioned I had my one of my trees on the rotation uh, And it did not work for me. So that was an epic fail. And I was a little disappointed, but I'm not going to let that get the best of me. So I'm going to vacuum this little area with my sharp. Uh, 
these beautiful curtains I had got from Kirkland, uh, I think like five years ago. I just love them. They fit this room so perfectly. Um, and the mirror, I got that from Target for $29. And then the A, um, that was at the at-home store that I got the A from. And I paid $9.99 for that. So, um, let's bring up the rotating, um, for the tree and we're going to see how that's going to work out. So this is what I have. I got it from Hobby Lobby um, and it was 50% off. So this is what it looks like. It also has a cord right there for plugging up the tree. And I'm going to put this on the floor. Okay, this is the... Cord. The cord is not that long, but I do have an extension cord that I'm going to use. And it's a little dusty, so I'm going to clean the top off of it with a, a little Lysol. Oh, boy, I tell you. I um, am so busy. So this is a slim tree. This is the bottom of the tree. And I got this tree from um, Home Goods, actually. So I'm going to put this in the rotator spinner to see. If it will fit. That's a yes. Um. Yeah. This fits. Wonderful. Okay. So, before I add the other one, I'm going to fluff this. And this is what it's looking like. It's a slim tree. I got it by the mirror. I think the reflection from the mirror is going to make the tree even stand out more. Um, and this is my tea room. So I just wanted to give you guys a close up. And it does fit. Now with my micro light tree, the bottom of it was so skinny and narrow it didn't fit at all but the it fits the slim tree for some reason so i'm gonna fluff this tree and then i'll put the other top on now this comes in three i was really surprised that it comes in three sections easy to plug up So I pretty much touched every branch and um, the tree looks very simple. This is the bottom of the tree. So it comes A, B, and C, which I really was surprised because by it being a slim tree, I thought it would just be two parts. And over here, I want to show you guys there's a plug right here 
And I like the idea they have it hanging outside so you easily can find. Because like I said, my boss up tree has been giving me so many problems. Um, but I finally got it together. And I will be showing that in a home tour. So this is what it's looking like so far. So I'm going to add the middle piece to the tree. And I paid uh, $99 for this tree. I always wanted a slim tree. Um, so this year I decided to get one. Simple. And here's the cord. And then I can see the other cord. Nothing too difficult for me. And I connected the two. I'm just going to leave that like that. And the bottom already fluffed out, but I know I'll probably go over it again. Um, and I'm just going to, um, fluff out the branches. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Got a frog in my throat for some reason. And here's the other cord for the top part. So this is what I like about this tree. It's simple. No fuss. Um, I did vacuum, but I will vacuum again just in case they're a little flocking from this tree. And I can tell you right now it's not much, which is a plus in my book. Um, so my carpet in here is like a black carpet, black night carpet. So, um, yeah, this is coming along nicely. Don't worry, I will cut this off. This is a slim lock tree, 334 tips, 22 inches wide. And it has 300 clear lights. It comes with a metal stand. So, that answers you guys' question. What type of tree it is. How much I paid for it. And also, what my theme is. Now, remember, my theme, I come in here, I meditate... And why not do musical, like musical instruments? That's going to be my theme. So, this is just the fluffing of the tree. Um, I will show you later on how I decorate this tea room. We're going to start room by room because why? It's the best thing to do. Um, that way my mind is not bottled and wondering what I got to do with this room, how I'm going to do that. Just do one room at a time. And like I said, I sit in here, I drink my tea, or once in a while I have cocoa. And this is like my relaxation room. I can meditate. I can think. Um, and I love it. So. This used to be a bedroom. But. My grandkids. They're getting older now. They have football. Basketball soccer, they're into all kinds of sports. They don't have much time for Nana. 
but it's okay. They still love to come by now and then, and I appreciate that. And I still have plenty of room for them to spend the night when they decide they want to spend the night. But once they become teenagers, they got a life of their own. They keep mommy and daddy busy. So, I love it. I love it. I love it. Ooh, it's coming out nice. Very nice. So, I'm going to put the top part on. Okay, so the top part is going to go on. It's a pre-lit tree. And I'm going to put that on the top. And this is a seven foot, just so you guys know. And I'm going to put the top on. Gotta go over there with the plug because I see the plug right here. So let me. Matter of fact, I want to show you guys something. See how small this is? That's how that um my boss up tree was, and it didn't fit the the spinner, the rotator. I don't know why. Um, and they had two other adapters to, uh, so it can fit, but it just didn't. I used both of them and it just was not working out. But anywho, we have this tree together and I'm just leaving these out for now. So, actually, I'm going to turn this one toward the back, so I'm going to unplug it. And, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Let me just put this on my sofa. Um, they have to come out. But I can, you know what? I can rotate this. That's right. So I'm going to plug this up. And I'm going to do the same process. Uh, touch each branch. Now, I'll probably go back over this later on this evening. Because I know me. Um, just to make sure this tree can have its full potential and it fits this room perfectly so this is my seven foot slim tree And I'm loving it. I am loving how it's turning out. And I will be cutting the tags off of it. But just to give you guys a general idea, this is what it's looking like. Oh, of course, I will plug it up so you guys can see. And I will go back over it probably two or three more times uh, just to make sure every branch is covered. Loving it, loving it. Voila. So this is my slim tree. Seven inch pre-lit 
uh, has 300 warm lights on it. And I'm going to show you guys what it looks like lit up. Wonderful. So this is what it looks like lit up. How gorgeous is that? And I haven't even decorated it yet. But I like the reflection from the mirror. That is just so gorgeous to me. So I have it on the rotating spinner. And it is fabulous. And I'm going to show you, there's not much flocking on the floor, which is nice. And I got black carpet, so I just want to make sure that was not going to be a lot of flocking. So I love this tree even more. And look at it. It's just gorge. Yes. So I will see you guys in the next episode. Um, I'm going to cut the tags off this tree. And I will bring you guys along to decorate with me. So I just want to say thank you for watching. Appreciate it. Love you guys. Bye.